Hello and welcome back to Mind Magic 7 for Blood and Honor. We are in Ion and we're trying to spend the night here. Let's see how that works out. Um, we're fighting rocks in a place with a whole bunch of rocks. And we can also fly. Let's not forget that quite important part. Um, no, why are we right on top of a bird? Okay, there we go. Let's go! And fight more birds! Let's try to have the birds not get too far in the sky. more rocks over there, but they don't seem to be coming at us. I think that one just randomly wandered into our range. Yes. There's still quite a lot of them there, but I'm wondering if at this point I could use a meteor shower. Well, clearly not, because we still don't have them in range. Okay, here, let's see what happens. I don't yeah, know. somewhat effective, somewhat effective. But now probably it wouldn't be very effective, right? Hmm, somewhat. I don't know. The Thunderbird in particular is not impressed. night. Oh. I don't know. And the great rock know. is running away. I don't really want you to be running away, so here's some acid. They actually cast lightning bolts like in Here's My Magic 3. Ow. But probably not. Most likely they just cause a lot of damage. Okay, so continuing on exploring this area. There's something out there. Oh, that one. It's a great rock. Well, that's great. Um, might as well use Meteor Shower. Wasn't very effective, but hey. This probably should be quite effective. 
I don't know. Yes, that was very effective. So what do we have here? Another set of rocks. Um running out of slow points. That's not good. Okay, how about you cast meteor shower over there? Yes. Hey, that rock is running away. Um, wait, I don't want to cast so that... oh. Yeah, we need to be able to use the town portal. Um, so we're out of spell points, actually. Uh. And the fly will prevent me from regenerating spell points. It's a greater rock, that's not a regular rock. Okay, well, let's stay on the ground. <coughs> so that I can regenerate my spell points. supposed to hurt? Huh, interesting. Got protected by my protection from magic. Ow. Yes. Rude. so much. Huh, stuns. I'm not sure what that does though. Seems to push them backwards, but uh, what's the point of that? Got your spell points back. Let's go to Harmondale. And get our spell points back. Do you need medical attention? Yes, we do. Okay, anyone else? Take care. Nobody else really needs it. So... Mm. Well, while we're here... Okay, back to my own. And where were we? Yeah, we went up and then down, although we could also go from this direction. Well, that might be a good idea. Um, also, I need heroism and bless. Okay, 
so far so good. We don't want to go too fast. And there's the birds. Mm, they're in a pretty nice position actually. I want them to come here. A little bit. Yes, and I think meteor shower here is going to be effective. Somewhat. Think you're going? I don't know. Whoa, rocks. This is probably too close for a meteor shower. Oops. Another word. Uh oh. But a scratch. Is that supposed to hurt? Ah. Hey, rude. Is that supposed to hurt? Ow. That. Oh, that's another Thunderbird. And we're kind of stuck here. Is that supposed to hurt? my protection for magic. 22 minutes. I should recast it. Okay, it's quite annoying because Usually all protections are like this, but the protection for magic is like that. Okay, let's see. Anyone else out there? Let's also cast preservation just for being on the safe side. And what else is running low torchlight? Useful when it's night. Oops. Ah, that. Alright. There seem to be a few more birds out there. Oops, no. 
Hmm. I'm not sure which one of these is closer. Okay, those ones. So that means we can hit them, but we can use Meteor Shower. Yeah, that worked somewhat. And maybe another meteor shower. Somewhat effective, but not completely. Hey, 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 where are I you going? I don't know. Oh, it's Thunderbird. <laughs> Running away when flying is very effective. Well, the interesting thing is that we are at the town now. Need to be careful here. <laughs> you missed. Seems that the Warlocks are moving too fast for the Thunderbird to catch them. Alright. So, this is done. So take this gold. Okay, now the way should be mostly clear. Keep an eye on the fly. Yeah, good.
Okay, another bird somewhere. Oh, it's a regular rock. Is that the rock that ran away? something out there, but I think they were the ones that were running away. Hey, we found this. What is this? Altar. Personality and intellect. Permanent. Nice. Alright, but that's not really what we uh, actually went here for. We're looking for the maze. Um, okay, let's go back up there somewhere. That a no, I thought that was a chest or something. <clears throat> and there goes the rock. So let's continue flying northwards. There was um So what can we find over here? Some more rocks, I suppose. Oh yes, there are certainly more rocks here. Okay, that was simple. That's not a rock, that's a crow. <laughs> oh, I didn't expect that rock to be the closer one. So that should be no problem to deal with, even with our regular arrows. Rocks, rocks, rocks. Is that supposed to hurt? Uh oh, that's a thunderbird. Go back down.
I'll still be careful. scratch. Well, that was an interesting turn of events. Um, not what I wanted to happen. Okay, there we go. You're still fine. Okay, how about the other ones out here? There's still one out there, but I think it's the one that's running away. Oh, there's an obelisk, I see. Um, yeah. In that case, I should go back and get my spell points back. Refresh my boss. Oh, yes. Okay, let's get back. attention yes take care and we can <coughs> finish off with going to the obelisk so now we know that it's over there we can just fly that way yeah fly still well for four hours Missing a whole bunch of treasure do treasure boxes in this night. But hey. I'll find them eventually. Yeah, that was just rock. What if I do that? Can I use a meteor shower successfully? Yes. I don't know. I don't know. A Thunderbird and a greater rock. Hmm, so generally I want to go over here. And then continue casting meteor showers. Because they're too close to the ground. I don't know. 
I don't know. It's funny that the Thunderbird is taking as much damage as the Greater Rock, despite the Greater Rock being significantly further away. <laughs> and there's more. Yeah, there's definitely more. And that's the Thunderbird. Well, let's pelt them with arrows. <laughs> what? No, get up there. <laughs> Because if I do this, it will not hit, right? No, it actually hits pretty well. I don't know. But this is probably too close, right? No, no, it's not. Interesting. I don't know. That's also not what I had in mind, but this is an interesting chance to get that guy killed. Right. Like this guy. So that probably the rock is too dumb, and it can't really figure out how to walk around the building. Hey rock, do you need some help? <laughs> it's really not sure what to do. <laughs> hey, you should go here, you know? Okay, good. And now you go over there. Okay. Yes, good. Yes, very good. Thank you. So, we managed to kill... No, don't go to Thunderfest Mountain. Managed to kill this guy. And the rock. Success. And I think that means that... Hey, that's a nice skull. A bunch of skulls. Quite a lot of skulls. Um, I think I can now get... Everything from here. Including these Thunderbirds. That one. And these ones. That one. Yes, I think we are good. 
And the obelisk is... Field! We have 1, 3, 4, 5, 9, 10, 12, 13, 14. Uh, we're getting somewhere. Still haven't explored everything in the world, but we're getting somewhere. So, see you all next time when we explore more of the world. Later.